Radius Curb Ramp Installation Procedure by ADA Solutions. Be sure to read and understand all instructions prior to beginning installation. Review current federal, state, and local ADA guidelines before installing. Requirements may vary. Leave the protective plastic film on the surface and edges of the panel during installation. The protective film will keep the panel clean during the installation. Concrete characteristics shall be as specified in the contract documents. Maintain a slump range of 4 to 7 inches to permit the solid placement of the panels in the wet concrete. The concrete shall be poured and finished level, true and smooth to the required dimensions prior to the panel installation. Locate and mark the center of the radius ramp. Identify the arc line for the outer edge of the detectable warning system. All detectable warning panels for the radius ramp should be cut and verified prior to pouring the concrete. Center the first panel at the middle of the ramp. Position the corners of the panel on the arc line. Position the second panel on top of the first panel and align the outer corners at the overlap. Position the corners of the second panel on the arc line. Locate the intersection of the panel edges with a square ruler and apply cut marks at the edge location. Mark a cut line from the outer corners of each panel to the cut marks on the opposite side. Use a straight edge to help guide the saw along the cut line. Make cuts on both panels. Locate both panels into position along the arc line and verify for proper fit. Repeat the marking and cutting steps for the remaining panels along the radius of the ramp. Pour the concrete for the radius ramp. The finish should be level, true, and smooth. From the street side of the ramp, place the center panel in position along the arc line. Rotate the detectable warning panel down into the wet concrete surface and verify that the placement is correct. Starting at one side of the panel, use a rubber mallet and a scrap piece of wood to tamp the panel into the wet concrete. Move across the panel, allowing any trapped air to escape. Continue until the surface is flush with the surrounding concrete. Install the next adjacent panel in the same manner as the first panel. Continue to install individual panels along the arc line. Try to maintain contact between panel edges with a maximum gap of 1 8 inch between adjacent panels. Use a quarter inch edge trowel to finish around the perimeter of the panels to allow for expansion and contraction.
Remove the plastic protective film within 48 hours of installation. ADA Solutions, the industry leader in detectable warning surfaces.